Hello everybody, hope you had a lovely weekend, uh, hope you had a nice uh, Easter dinner if you celebrate Easter. Um, I took my girls out Saturday out into the woods and to a little quarry. It was a beautiful day, um, kind of mild, not too hot, uh, crystal clear skies, it was really nice. And we went and collected all kinds of stuff. I ended up finding a couple of ulna bones. These are looking a little rough, so I don't know how well they'll do. And then here's another. I'm hoping that these might make from some fine edge flakers. You can see they're pretty long. This has usually got like a little triangular nubbin on the end, but this will get, it's also twisted back to here. So we'll probably cut this back to about here. Um, so we found those. Found. Found a whole bunch of hammer stones, and we're gonna go ahead and test those out today. And, and I found this neat piece of I think this is some type of slate, but I was digging in the riverbed with it um, at the river, the little creek. And I found this uh, rock that has a really tight grain structure, and it was flaking nice sharp flakes. So, this might make a point of local material. And last but not least, I found some trash porcelain. I think it's porcelain. It's about five eighths thick and it was a large piece. And while I was out, I was able to, I buy faces with a hammer. Never mind. <laughs> I'll grab it. But I was able to buy faces with a hammer stone. Got a lot of work yet to do. But it's pretty good quality. The grain is super tight. Um, and the flakes, when they were popping off, they were razor sharp. Um, I ended up just burying uh, the flakes and debitage that was left over. Kind of, I kind of heel cut a, a little ditch and then flaked over that. And then just kind of put everything in there. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to probably play with some hammer stones i want to try to pick out a few of my favorites and then uh we'll see if we can work up uh, at least a biface or a point if not maybe we'll just switch gears and do a flake point you know, it's kind of a i don't really have anything planned i was just wanted to share my weekend with you guys so without further ado let's pick a hammer stone This one might be too hard. It was really dry, so some of this stuff. Like here's a good one. This one here, it's got a softness to it. Not, it's hard to explain. It's like a soft grittiness. It almost feels. Um, it's hard to explain, but it's like a soft hundred grit grittiness. But we'll give this one a try today. And it's got different rounded widths and faces and all that jazz, a little thumb hole even. So we'll see how it goes. I just work a random piece of chert here. So this is pretty powdery already. So I don't know how well this is gonna work. But we'll see. It smells like fuel. That's weird. It's plenty strong enough. Alright, uh, now I get two. Let's grab a different rock. <laughs> Ugh, dropping stuff. Let's try 
the smaller one here. I like the way this fits in my hand. It smells funny. It smells like uh, oil. Or like a uh, kerosene almost. It's weird. Or, uh, um, asphalt, almost. I don't know what it is. Hopefully it's not poisonous. Nibble this up, make this the base, this the tip. Must be in a breaking mood today. I mean, I thinned it, but it blew out this whole back end. So, that's kind of a bummer. It's risky hitting them on the end like that because you get end shark. But... I like the way this feels in the hand. Good weight. I think it's got good grabbiness. So I think this one's a keeper. I just wish I knew why it smelled. It's strange. It's working. I like the way it fits. Let's go grab a different keeper. Grab one of these smaller ones. Here's a little bitty guy. So again, it's got that softness. It's hard to explain. It's it's got I'm trying to see if I can find an example. So here's another one that's got a softness to it. Let's see if I can find one that's just hard. So here, this one's super tight, and this one's a lot harder. It's a lot more slick. This isn't the best hammer stone. So you want something with a little bit of grippy, grabby texture. That's a, a Marty Ruder saying there. So we'll go ahead and play with this one a little bit. It's a lot smaller. Tattoo song. This one's not bad. This is a nice small size one. It's very powdery. It's grabbing, it's doing the job. You can see the scoring, but it's 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 powdery, but it's tight. So we'll see. It's not a bad one.
Here we go. I think this one is straight sandstone. This one's a lot more grippy and grabby. Just another little round one. Let's have this one. Oh, it's another really soft one. I don't know if you can see it or not. You can see it's powdery. Might be too soft. It's grabbing though. It may be soft, but it is grabbing. I like this one because I had a little end here and a big end. I don't know, I kind of like them when they're all irregular. Another powdery one. I wonder what kind of rock this is. pretty good. I just gotta hit my platform. It's part of the battle. Whoops. Another one. More st still has that softness. What I was looking for was sandstone. Yeah, that's another powdery one. Weird. Very weird. I don't know what it is.
I think this is actually sandstone. This one's definitely a keeper. this one. I know you see a lot of guys when they use hammer stones they like to hold them like this. I find it way more comfortable to hit it like this. I don't know why. I just I just do. set this aside got a little by face let's keep playing with hammer stones here just another small piece of ridge a little darker let's play with this one some more maybe not with this one. here we go maybe something a little bit more ugly Got a crack right here. Square in. okay now we have two looks like it had a crack in it you can see the color change in it now I fixed it no. <sighs> sad Let's see we got another one. here we go there's another one nice little potato looking thing See how that one feels. Another 
powdery one. Really soft. I don't know if that's gonna work. Got a bit of a mess here in the tip. This one's not too bad. It's a little soft, and it may end up just being like an outer shell of erosion. So I don't know how long it'll last, but I mean, it's doing its job. I like how skinny it is. I can get in there and get some of those spots. That's cool. So we've got a really cool seam of something here. All right, so we're gonna put this up there with the keepers. So this one I found, I was actually using it to test for paint colors. I think this might be too hard, but we'll try. You can hear the difference. I guess not, Never mind. Ah, you can feel the slickness. So I can, I can, it's, it's very little resistance when you do this. So I don't know if this will work. We'll try.
bag, it's working pretty good. So here's where we're at. It's got, an, again, soft roughness. This one's a lot more rough, but it feels more like sandstone. We'll try this one out. Oh, that's really soft. That's not working. What's nice about hammer stones is you can decide to try to hit it here and then just boink right across and it seems to work pretty good. This is working alright. It's starting to fall apart. So here's where we're at. I got a problem area I gotta fix, which is over here, on this opposite side. So we're getting there. That one's okay. It's not great. Most of the ones I found were a lot bigger. Maybe one of these. harder. This one I might have found in the creek. Which I probably should have let dry a little bit.
got a hump right here that's giving me fits. You can see it's like burnt. I gotta turn that platform all the way up to get to it. But I can also lose some material here as well. It'd be cool to do a football shape type piece, I think. But we're starting to run out of size. I still got a lot of problem areas. problem area right here so we've got to pull the sides in to thin that but I also got to get rid of this stuff here we'll save that for tomorrow see what time is it we got four more minutes we'll play with some more <laughs> I don't know how this one's gonna go it looks like it might be might have a lot of cracks on it so we'll see Ready. Nice and waxy. Hey, that is sandstone. I broke it. 
Too much power. Hi on that one.
I should stop hitting it. Dummy. there. Let me turn this timer off real quick. See all the crud in there. I knew I was going to be battling cracks, so I was hoping some would stay together. Alright, we still might be able to get some out of here.
better get back inside. So here's where we're at. I think we gotta we gotta go in the right direction. If it stays together, <laughs> we'll see. I might be able to thin that from this side. Get everything neat and organized. So I might be able to shoot underneath it, but we don't really know what's underneath there to cause additional problems. But so a little bit of hammerstone bifacing for you guys. Thanks for watching.